uh, new government in the United Kingdom is facing, as we all are, an enormous financial challenge. Um, and they have taken an interesting approach, something they call the big society, uh, which is a sort of a devolution to citizens, uh, much like community policing, except it's civic engagement on a broad scale, using the government to sort of lead and organize and uh, provide data and support to citizens as they do the work um, in the neighborhoods and in the community that needs to be done. And as I sat and listened in this morning's City That Works session to the folks talking about animal control, code enforcement, uh, liquor control, and so on, it sounded to me like our city staff are using this same sort of strategy in a very positive way. For example, working with uh, the Ivanhoe neighborhood, the Blue Hills neighborhood, and so forth, to pay them to maintain the lots in their neighborhoods. Uh, they're finding that they can do more work with less money. Uh, working with uh, animal rights and, and pet owners and people who are concerned about animal control to improve licensure and enforcement, uh, again, in sort of a cooperative way. Uh, using volunteer inspectors uh, to do a lot of the code enforcement work. We have 52 uh, inspectors and it turns out that citizen volunteers can do a lot of that work. And it's not like we would suddenly lay off the 52 inspectors. There's plenty of other work for them to do. But having the government do more of what used to be called steering and less of rowing seems to be a very positive sort of overall strategy. It's working in the UK, and I think it can work in Kansas City.